Welcome back to our channel. At this video we will learn new Primavera P6 tricks. At the end of this video, you will be able to know how to import activities and durations from Excel to Primavera P6. This is totally free tutorial, so don't forget to support us by clicking the thumb up and subscribe. Without wasting time, let's start. I have to add one activity at least at our schedule. Then I'll export my file from here. I will choose the option spreadsheet from here. Click next and I will export only the activities. Then I'll select the project to export by click at this square here. Then click next. Now I will modify my layout. I will choose activity ID activity status. I need the original duration as well. I will add the original duration. Then click OK and click Next. Now from here I will choose the location I want to save my file at. Then click Next. And then Finish. Now the export is completed. I'll minimize this one and here is the result of our export. Double click and I can see everything inside my sheet. Let me arrange my columns so it will be more clear. I have prepared earlier a list of my activities and expected duration at a different sheet. So, simply I will copy the activity's name. Then I'll paste it under activity name at our exported file here. So here under activity name, I will paste those new activities as we can see here. I will drag the activity ID here so this will be the new activity ID for each new activity. Each activity ID should be unique. For activity status it all not started. So, I will copy and paste the same status here. For WBS code it will be under the same WBS. So, I will copy and paste the same. For original duration, I will copy this information from the sheet I have prepared earlier. So, I will highlight all, and then click on copy. Then I will go back to the exported sheet. And I will paste the durations here. Since I will link the activities at Primavera after importing, so we'll keep the start and finish date for now the same. After I add the original duration here, I will change the figures to text. So, from data, I will choose text column from here. Here I'll choose the option comma. Click on next. Then choose option text. Now click on finish. So, now the Primavera P6 will understand those figures as a duration. So, it should be a text format. So, let's save this file, and we will open the Primavera P6. Now from import, I will choose import spreadsheet. Then click next. Choose the files we modified from here. This file will import the activities to our schedule. Choose activities from here. Next import to my program. Now click next. Then finish. Now Primavera have imported the new activities to our schedule. Wish this video was useful. Thanks for watching.